What's up everybody? Welcome back. Patrick here. In this question, we're told that a triangle has a perimeter of 11x plus 7y minus 4. Two of the sides are 4x minus 3y and 3x plus 4y minus 7 respectively. What is the length of the third side? So we're given this triangle here and we're told that one of the sides has a length of 4x minus 3y. Then we're told another side has length 3x plus 4y minus 7. And we have to find this third side. Let's call it side 3. Now, in general, the uh, perimeter of a triangle is what? It's going to be side 1 plus side 2 plus side 3. And that's going to give us the perimeter. Right perimeter of a triangle is all three sides added up. Well, if we want to isolate for this side three here, side three is just going to be what? It's going to be the perimeter of the triangle minus side one minus side two. If we bring both of these to the right side, and that makes sense. The full perimeter of a triangle, subtract two of the sides, get the length of the third side. Well, now with this formula here, we can just plug in everything that we have. So the perimeter of the triangle we're told is 11x plus 7y minus 4. So that there is the perimeter minus side 1. Let's call it 4x minus 3y. And we're subtracting that whole expression because that whole expression represents the whole side of the triangle. So you got to make sure you put that in brackets. Then we're subtracting the second side, which is 3x plus 4y minus 7. Then from here, we can just simplify. So there's nothing in front of the bracket here. There's like a 1, so we could get rid of this first bracket. Here, we'll have to distribute the negative inside, so we'll have minus 4x plus 3y. And then here, we'll have to distribute the negative, so minus 3x minus 4y plus 7. So now, we can just collect all of the like terms. So we have 11x minus 4x minus 3x. That would give us what? Uh, 4x? Right, 11 minus 4 is 7, 7 minus 3 is 4. So 4x is there. And we got 7y plus 3y gives us 10y minus 4y gives us positive 6y. And then we got minus 4 plus 7, so that gives us positive 3. So that is the expression for the third side, 4x plus 6y plus 3. And you can actually check your answer. So you can take this side 3, put it here. And then what you can do is you could add up these three sides and make sure you get that expression for the perimeter. And if you did that, you would. So 4x plus 3x plus 4x gives us 11x. Minus 3y plus 4y gives us uh, positive 1y plus 6y gives us 7y. And then minus 3 plus or uh, minus 7 plus 3 gives us minus 4. So that there is the expression for the third side.